So the trigonometrical ratio, that is any trigonometrical ratio, is referred as T ratio. Okay. Now we are going to consider the names of the six trigonometrical ratios, which is which are there in a triangle. Okay. So first trigonometric ratio is sine, and it is abbreviated as SIN, and it is also read as sine. Okay. Some student sound very funny by reading this as sin. Okay. So make it a point. It is sine. It is read as sine. Okay. The second T ratio is cosine and it is abbreviated as COS and it is read as cos. Okay. The third trigonometrical ratio is tangent and it is read as 10. The fourth is cotangent and it is read as cot. Fifth is second, it is read as sec. The sixth degree ratio is cosecant. It is abbreviated as COSEC or CSC. It is widely used as this abbreviation in Indian books and in foreign books it is written as CSC and it is read as COSAC. So COSECOND in short is read as COSAC. Okay, so we have heard the names of six T ratios, but what do these ratios mean? What do these ratios stand for? For this, we should know a few things. Okay. To describe the T ratios like sine, cosine, etc., which we have discussed in any triangle, for example, triangle ABC, which is a right angle triangle, we have to name the sides of the triangle. We have to differentiate the sides of the triangle according to the trigonometry okay so first thing which we have to do is to name the hypotenuse it is the longest side in right angle triangle and it is opposite to 90 degree angle okay actually you cannot get the hypotenuse wrong it is very easy to remember and name it okay Firstly, it is the longest side in a right angle triangle and it is the side opposite to the 90 degree angle. Okay, so in triangle ABC, the side AB is the hypotenuse. Okay, 